Hello everyone, I'm Veronica and welcome to another Saturday story time. Let's get started with our hello song. Hello friends. Hello friends. Hello friends. It's time to say hello. Good job. So I have a really fun story for us today. If you click on the link up above and go to Storyline Online and listen to Quackenstein Hatches a Family by Sudipta Bartham Quallen and illustrated by Brian T. Jones. And this is a really good story. It has some fun rhymes in it. It has a surprise ending and it's pretty funny. So if you go listen to that story and then when you come back, we're going to do a song and it's called 10 Little Eggs. So let's make sure I have enough eggs here. Let's count them. Are you ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's 10 little eggs. So that's our story, and we're going to be doing different things as the story goes along. We're going to figure out what is behind these eggs. And as we do, every time an egg cracks open, we're going to clap. And every time the animal is revealed, well, there might be different sounds we're going to do. So if I do a sound, just copy me and have fun with it. So it goes like this. This is 10 little eggs, and you can hold up 10 fingers to start with. Here it goes. 10 little eggs, and what do we see? They're about to crack open. My goodness me, says Mother Hen. Here's Mother Hen. The first egg cracks open, and what do we see? What do you think is going to be behind the egg? A fuzzy little duckling is looking at me. Look at that. What does a duck say? Quack, 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 quack. Okay, now we're on the next one, ready? The second egg cracks open. And what do we see? That's gonna be behind the second egg, the purple egg. A little purple dinosaur is looking at me. Can you roar like a dinosaur? Roar! The third egg cracks open. And what do we see? What do you think is going to be behind the third egg? A little turkey gobbler looking at me. Can you gobble like a turkey? The fourth egg cracks open. And what do we see? A little fluffy owl is looking at me. What does an owl say? Go, hoo, 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 hoo. The fifth egg cracks open. And what do we see? It's a little platypus looking at me. Just like in the story. And what sound does a platypus make? Does anyone know what sound a platypus makes? It's kind of like a purr growl thing. Are you ready? Can you copy me? Can you do? <sighs> it's kind of like that. Can you make that sound? And that's five. We have five. So there's five left. So this is number six. Ready? The sixth egg cracks open. And what do we see? A pretty little blue bird looking at me. Can you tweet like a bird? Tweet, 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 tweet. Seventh egg cracks open. And what do we see? What do you think is going to be behind this egg? A snappy little alligator is looking at me. Can you snap like an alligator? Snap, 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 snap. Now we're on number eight. Ready? 
the eighth egg cracks open. And what do we see? A long-necked ostrich looking at me. Look at that. Can you stretch like an ostrich? Stretch super high. Stretch high. Long-necked ostrich. The ninth egg cracks open. And what do we see? It's a little green turtle looking at me. Can you move really slow like a turtle? Ready? Slow. Slow. Last one, ready? The tenth egg cracks open. And what do we see? It's a little yellow chick looking at me. Can you cheep like a little chick? Cheep, 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 cheep. My baby, says the mother hen, as happy as can be. Mama, says the little chick, did you meet all my brothers and sisters? Oh, goodness me, says the mother hen. The end. That's the whole song. So you meet a lot of fun little animals and you get to do a lot of different sounds. And there's other things you could do as well. You don't have to go all the way to 10 if that seems a bit much. You could just do three or five or something in between, however many you want to do. And another way you can do this song, I've been doing this a little bit with my um, live story times on Tuesdays and Wednesdays, but you could have all these different colored eggs and just have them up there. And you can just ask the child to pick a color of egg. So you could say that you want to find the platypus. Which one is the platypus behind? And have your child pick a color. And if they say, is the platypus behind the blue egg? You can look and see, no, that's the blue bird. And you can still make all the sounds and everything and make it kind of like an adventure of where's the platypus until you find it. And then you can keep going for the other ones if you want, or you can just stop. So there's different ways that you can incorporate the song or do the song. And don't forget to check out my live story times on Tuesdays at 5.30 p.m. and Wednesdays at 10.30 a.m. via Zoom. And we do songs and lots of fun stories there as well. But until next week, we'll sing our goodbye song. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. It's time to say goodbye. Goodbye.